When you're focused on building your reputation as a brand, you'll quickly realize how important it is to deliver value to your audience. It's not enough to capture their attention once and then never connect with them again. You have to keep their attention by consistently delivering content in order to leave a memorable impression. And one of the best ways you can do this is by starting an email newsletter. I'm Angel Marie, creator educator over at ConvertKit. Let's get started. By starting an email newsletter, you're gonna have the opportunity to connect with your subscribers with personalized and educational content. Now, in order to collect those subscribers, you can use a newsletter landing page to attract visitors and persuade them to join your email list. Now, a newsletter landing page should have a few key important elements to it. A headline that captures your audience's attention, a descriptive copy that explains why they should sign up in the first place, imagery, that leaves a memorable impression, and a call to action button that encourages your audience to take action. Let's go ahead and transition into a demo of ConvertKit so that you know how to create a free newsletter or even a paid newsletter this very week. First, determine if a paid newsletter is right for you to begin with. Before we even dive into ConvertKit, you have to determine if launching a paid newsletter is right for you. Email newsletters might be a great business model, but you need to remember you're still running a business. That means you'll need to maintain a fixed schedule and deliver what you promise, or your subscribers will begin to churn. If you feel it's right for you, then to launch your paid newsletter in ConvertKit, you're just gonna head up here to the products tab and click on new product. From there, you're gonna choose a newsletter topic. Choose a topic that your audience is interested in learning about, but also one that you're experienced with and interested in sharing your knowledge on a weekly basis. Third, choose the right platform. Here at ConvertKit, we have a commerce platform where creators can sell their paid newsletters, subscriptions, right alongside their very own digital products. Fourth, you're gonna set your price. Now, I know that when it comes to the pricing, it could feel a little weird, but the good news is that you have plenty of options for creating a pricing model that's affordable for subscribers and profitable for you at the same time. You could charge a very small fee, like $5 a month to kickstart your audience, or you could charge a higher price, like $99 a month for exclusive content. From there, you're just gonna give your product uh, and your launched paid newsletter, a domain name, and the page URL that you'd like this to be. Fifth, kickstart your audience with free newsletter content. If you don't already have an email list, consider sharing your content for free through a landing page first before launching a paid newsletter as I'm showing you right here. That way, you're gonna be able to build loyal subscribers through your free newsletter content, and those people will more than likely pay for your paid newsletter subscription once you launch. So in this case, I'm just gonna create a free landing page. I'm gonna click on newsletter to choose a template that pertains to newsletters, and I'm just gonna go ahead and choose the template that I feel fits my business in the best way. You can customize it, let people know you're launching this free newsletter. Another amazing thing that you can even do is by heading to this plus button on the left-hand side and clicking on newsletter feed for it to filter in a, a sneak peek of what your newsletters look like. Now, if you want this to appear, just so that you can promote the kind of content that you're delivering, all you're gonna do is head to the broadcast tab in your account head to the broadcast emails that have already been sent, and you're gonna enable on public feeds. This is for the purpose of allowing it to show inside the newsletter feed on your landing pages. Six, promote your newsletter. Now, if you're launching a free newsletter, as I previously showed you on this landing page, all you're gonna do is click save and publish. You're gonna go to share and click to copy this link and paste it anywhere and everywhere you can to share the news about your free newsletter. If you're launching a paid newsletter via ConvertKit Commerce, as I demoed over here, all you're gonna do is create the product and you're gonna customize how you want the product page, the checkout page, the confirmation page, and the receipt email that your subscribers are going to be getting from you. You can customize that to your liking. And when you're all good to go, you're gonna click save 
head to publish. Now you can either click to copy this link and share your product, uh, your paid newsletter link right away, or you can even embed it, embed this button on your website to get subscribers opting in to your very own paid newsletter. And there you go, a newsletter landing page ready to launch to your potential subscribers. If you'd like to give it a try, you can sign up for ConvertKit right down below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.